New at five, another tragic loss shaking up life for a local family. After losing her mother to COVID, one woman is now struggling to fill her mom's shoe, shoes actually as a caregiver. NBC4's John Keddie's Klimak with their story. I made a promise to my dad that I would take care of uh, Ronnie and my mom. Annette Rio sat with her brother and her son this afternoon to tell us about her mom. She just like was the light of our life, you know. She was always around. She had the biggest heart, and she was she was just a beautiful person. Fabiola Rios was 85 years old when she became another COVID statistic. It started off with me, and then my daughter got it, and then my mom got it, my my brother got it. Ronnie has Down syndrome. At 58 years old, his mom was still his sole caregiver. That reality now falls on his sister. I need to take care of him. So. Okay, okay, wait. She just became so sick. She wasn't functioning properly. They took her to the hospital. She never came home. Annette says the hospital let her see her mom for just a moment Friday. By then, she was unconscious. This past Saturday morning, Annette says she walked in on her brother kneeling in prayer. I said, Are you praying for mom, Ronnie? And he said, Yes, I'm praying for mom. And, um, and then he kept pointing up, and then I got a telephone call, and it was the doctor, and I knew it wasn't going to be good news. The family's GoFundMe site already has more than 100 donors and raised more than $6,000. Money Annette says they'll use for funeral expenses and anything her brother might need going forward. But they wanted to share their story to show other families just how real the virus is. It's your loved ones, you know, that are passing. And it's very hard to deal with losing someone you love. We want people to know that life is precious now and to choose love and just stay safe. From Rialto, John Cadiz Klimak, NBC4 News.